How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another Car Mechanic Sim 2021 video. In today's video we're going to be finishing up the second half of this 1968 Dodge Charger Daytona. Uh, in the game obviously it's not called a... It's not called that, it's called a uh, Tempest Magnum. But it's definitely the Daytona. We still gotta do the paint job and I also have to do the engine transmission and exhaust. Uh, if you guys haven't seen the last video, I'd recommend going and watching that. That kind of has the breakdown of me starting it, uh, where I got it and everything, and uh, what we're shooting for. Uh, it is uh, drag strip slicks on it, so we're going to be taking on the drag strip later. Uh, should I think of anything else? I think that's it. All right, we're going to hop right into it. need to get the engine out and then i'm gonna get the rest of it done and then i will do the uh engine next i also i needed to check and see oh, too hot. my bad i need to check and see if i can put a uh tuning carburetor or a carburetor that can be tuned what you know there's watch there's gonna be none yep just like just a little bloop just a little, little bit. Alright, give me the motor. Put that back. And then... Let me see here, let me see here. Okay. Let's do... The rear. I'm gonna get all of the underbody done here. I think there is I think it's a dual motor as well, fuel tank. Let's take a look at all of the body parts. 78% is what the body is. I'm gonna drop off all of this. Let's see what we can do here. I know I got some few new parts I put on already to give the completed look, but Oh the wing is part of the body, okay. Uh, tail lights are new. Your window needs to come out though. Body window. Okay, so I should have like, yeah, like one or two things on. Let's see what we can repair here. Nice. So if I can repair everything, that's I definitely ideal. I think all I need to purchase is extra glass. Because you cannot repair anything glass. Which I guess kind of makes sense. And then grab some glass. Uh, just body shop, magnum, all the glass pieces. And then I have a new interior done as well, so I don't need to worry about that. Come on. I wish I could have faster selecting I grab two new license plates really quick uh, we'll go with Iowa I haven't done Iowa in a very long time the old Des Moines plates we're gonna call it All right, Daytona, two of these. Wow, that's crazy. Bumper's good, truck's good, plate's good. The rear glass in. Oh, wait, that's another one really good. All right, that means, oh, the body is not quite at 100. What are we missing? What are we missing? Missing something here. Windshield washer reservoir, valve off. Hmm. I'm not seeing it. Fuse box, truck, rear tail light C. Oh, 
Oh, these taillights. Oh, I didn't swap them out. Interesting. Okay, I, I had all the new ones. And now... We should be at 100. Yes, okay. What's the profit? 21,000 already? Not bad. Alright, I'm gonna go through and get the uh, motor all done. It's gonna be... I think just the same V8... Yeah, double carb overhead valve supercharged motor, which is what it already has in. I think that's I think that's definitely gonna be our highest horsepower. It'd either be that or the or the mag motor, but I think this one will definitely be the best. So I'm gonna get that completely decked out. Uh, all performance parts and everything. We'll see you guys back here with it installed in the motor. Alrighty, I'm back with the motor in the engine bay of the Daytona. I forgot how long it takes to build the overhead valve motors it is kind of brutal not gonna lie but i got that done i got most of the stuff i already need here so i gotta put all the fluids in uh let me see here i didn't realize that we were gonna have, or i was gonna have a full fuse box in this one pop out all these fuses All right, there's the box cover. What else? Anything else here in the engine bay other than fluids? I think I just have fluids to do now. Great. Fluid, little BO3. Power steering. Brake, power steering, coolant, windshield, and oil. Wow, there are five fluids oh yeah then as of recording today they just released the mercedes dlc so i think the next thing i want to try and work on is one of the remastered mercedes adds i think five new motors five new motors and i think like five new cars but different variations of the cars people can now do uh mods of the mercedes cars again this is a, a remaster dlc so i think it was in uh car mechanics in 2018 so it's coming back all right all the fluid is in i think i'm good in the upper end also i did put in the tuning carburetors so i think we can now do dyno tuning I think I can do dyno tuning though for uh, this. Uh, we're gonna hope it's gearbox A or non modded. Starter, nope, starter is kaput. Oh, starter's in electronics now, isn't it? Okay. Boom. Drive shaft, boom. Now, I think, I think I'm good. I think we're done. Let's say, 100, 100, 100, it is, all right. Let's get this bad boy moved to paint shop. So we're going for the, uh, the Daytona looking car in cars, which means this factory color is fine. Oh. Oh, there we go. As in the book. Whoa, you can change the metalness and everything. Oh, so it's like super chrome, not chrome. See, I see how rough the paint is. So it's like, whoa, that's crazy. Lots of clear coat, no clear coat, lots of clear coat, no clear coat. I'm going to reset this. Go back. All right. We're going to paint this bad boy. Dang, look at it. That's clean. What's it worth now? Oh, 132,000. 94K, a little profit. Well, I think that means I am now ready to dyno. I have all the fluids in, so we should be able to just run it. Let's get a stock dyno. All right. 
hoping for a thousand horsepower. Fingers crossed here. All right, let's see it. Not as good as I thought. Still an A class, which I think the other one I worked on was an A eight hundred. Is it an eight hundred or five eighty? But now, okay. So now I've never done this. Let me see. Need to match the wheels, wider position, better performance. Adding value to one wheel change the values on all motor carburetors. So I want this to be as oh as open as I can. Okay, I'm at ones across the board. I think I did it right. I I, I honestly I don't know. I've never done this before, so I'm gonna give this a few extra miles. Speed. All right, now we'll hit the dyno again. So it was, I think it was like 980 or 70 some there. I don't remember what it said actually. Let's see what it's at now though. Okay, it's it's definitely better. It went from 570 to 581. All right, let me move this thing back to A. Well, that's pretty good. I'm uh, I'm pretty happy with that. I don't think that really messes with. Yeah, it doesn't really mess with cost at all. Or uh, measure torque, 951. Okay, so it does keep these numbers. All right. That's pretty cool. All right, well, I'll run it on the drag strip now. I'm probably not going to enter it in the... Uh, I'm not going to enter it in the... What do you call it? Uh, the the tournament. Jeez. Uh, just because I don't really think I need to. Wheels are not aligned. Dang it. That's the problem. Take it back to... That's bad. Uh, I don't really want to run it on there. It's, it's fine. Just because, uh, oh man, these are, these are so out of whack. Um, just because it's probably not going to be worth a lot of money. I'm not going to make that much run in it. All right. Now you should be ready. Yep, let's go. I'll run it, uh, I'll probably do a one mile, see how fast I can get it going. I'm, honestly, I might top out. I didn't think I put it to like 220. I feel like I definitely might hit that 220 pretty easily. Um, We'll just run someone against me. Oh, we're f switch to someone else. Okay, we'll versus McLaren, who is technically better than us. My tuning is way higher than theirs, though. Whoa. Slick versus a race, 90 tuned. All right, all right. Let's see what you see what you got here, McLaren. Oh, look at that wood grain steering wheel. Right. Oh, I've never driven, driven this car before. I don't know where I'll top out at. Oh, it's McLaren's taking off. Oh no, I need to gear up way more. Oh wow, that McLaren absolutely boomed me. Oh wow. It was like close in the eighth mile, but <laughs> right after that, he just started absolutely gapping me by seconds. Wow, that was. My bustlings. That was rough. 
All right, well, good thing to know. I need to, uh, I need to learn how to, uh, set my shifting correctly, and so I need to, I need to definitely change the gears around, but there we go, guys. We're gonna end the video there. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'm gonna be looking for one of the Mercedes DLC cars next so I can find it, uh, but I do have a bunch of other cars I still want to work on. I still have, like, the Batmobile and stuff like that, and a bunch of other uh, weird and wacky ones that I want to do, but you guys enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this little mini series here with the daytona leave a like comment down below uh let me know what you guys want to see next and i'll see you in the next car mechanic sim 2021 video